what? You gotta uh, be merciful to your brother, man. You know, you gotta be, you gotta have mercy on your Akio, man. Hey, we, 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 our, our righteousness is nothing but filthy rags, man. We all fall sometimes, man, and, and mess up, man. Ain't none of us perfect, man. We trying to be perfect, man. That's why I said it says put on as the elect. That's the, going into a conversation dealing with your conduct, your actions. Like, look, the scripture said we don't make ourselves that number. We can't name the elect by name. Oh, this brother is the elect for sure, guaranteed. All we got is the blueprint, which is the Bible, which told us what the elect gonna be doing. So if the elect said, hey, no gal, the scripture says, uh, no gal shall be found in that mouth. The word gal meaning deceit. We out here telling you people the truth. You know, uh, unadulterated, unfiltered. Because if, if it's given to you any other way, that's what deceit. So that's that's what it, you know, put on as the elect. You know, be a brother, you know, uh, according to what the scripture has said. John 7 38, he that believeth on me as the scripture have said, out of his, his belly shall flow rivers of living water. water. And when you believe something, when you truly believe something, it'll, it'll, it, it, uh, it, it, it causes you to act. It influences your actions. Like, like if I tell your house on fire, if you believe me, you're gonna do everything on your power to get out of that house. Yep. And we telling me, and we telling people that America is on fire. America is that great house that's on fire. And uh, we tell you that uh, the Most High, whom the world calls God, the God of the Bible, he got a problem with America. And we proving it to you with, through the prophecy. I appreciate it. I was still holding that Psalms 83. Did you? Right, you come back to it. Go I got back to one. Uh, you can tell it's a lot. Go, go ahead. Go you got a precept. Go ahead, brother. Pull up your precept, Uh, We stopped at 3. This is Psalms 83, verse 3. They that hate are slack you. It says, They have taken crafty counsel against thine people and consulted against thine hidden ones. Yes, the Lord's people is the Israelites. So called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, and we're gonna keep saying it. All right? Now, how did they take that crafty counsel? All these heathen nations, which 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 is gonna name, they got together and said, now we understand whatever beef and whatever issue we got with each other, okay, we'll deal with that. But these people, we gotta do something about these people in particular. Because if these people understand who they are and serve the most high, can you get a, a, a Jeremiah 50 and 7? Jeremiah 50 and 7 kind. kind. If these people doing what they supposed to do, then we ain't got no hope. You know what I mean? So these people understand that. Like when you, if you ever, you ever come, you know, when we first come to the truth, you know, we do that sometimes. We might have a conversation with, with the, with the, uh, the Arab man that owns the Sharks Chicken or the gas station man. You know, pick their brain a little bit. These people know and understand that. Yep. Read that fifty. At fifty-seven. Yeah. I mean, at fifty and seven. Okay. Jeremiah chapter fifty, verse seven. All that found them, I'll start at 6. My people have been lost, uh, Jeremiah 50, verse 6. My people have been lost sheep. Their shepherds have caused them to go astray. Yeah, we got on them earlier. You fake, you, you false pastors, you false prophets. You cause people to go astray from the word. It says, they have turned them away on mountains. They have gone from mountain to hill. Yeah, the, uh, these other these other religions, these other nationalities. Oh, how do you serve your God? Oh, y'all do this, and no, and it shouldn't be a, a Negro Buddhist. It shouldn't be a a, a, a Negro Muslim, man. Okay. Okay. Uh, Korean Jesus. Hey. Right, right. Okay. Korean okay. Jesus. Okay. What's that shit you say on girl with that too? Oh, oh, the, but they got this shit called the Baha'i Baha thing. Baha'i. Baha From East India, man. They like the hand with the eye in it and shit. The well, symbol. well, different people use that. Even the, even the people, the, the fake Jews, the so-called Jews, do that shit. That the, the mumsa, hand mumsa. Some, it's, it's just wicked. But hey, uh, in the Old Testament, isn't the uh, the high places referred to them going up to them idols, worshiping gods? Mm -hmm. That's why it says uh, they have gone from mountain to hill. Mm -hmm. They have gone from mountain to hill because what? Those are those high. Those are those high places where they go to worship these idols. You know, it says that they have gone from mountain to hill. They have forgotten their resting place. All that found them have devoured them, and their uh, uh, Isaiah 29 and 13. Uh, read that part over. Resting place. It says they have forgotten their resting place. Yeah, because uh, the oh wow, <laughs> the Baha'i faith. 
teachings, religion, and the uh, faith of all, the teachings, the faith of all religions. Huh? So I came from the Catholic Church, man, which Catholic means what? Uh, universal. You know? All right, so for higher faith, that shit comes from the same, it comes from the same thing. I have this, this lady, you know, and she, I, I, thought, I thought she was Christian. My brother said, nah, man, she believes in East Indian shit called Bahai and Faith. I just looked it up. So that's a study of all, all religions. That's, that's right. That's, 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 a, that's a Michael, what's his name? Michael E. York? Yeah, well, what's, what's I, his name? Well, I, I don't know how to start it, but I never even my Yeah, yeah. And I, um, I just looked it up, so, so, hey, man, we're, 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 this is not a religion, man. Yeah. No? And she's a woman anyway, man, so she can't get it, man. All right, go ahead. Go ahead, brother. No, it is. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you have a precept? No, read that part over. It says, they have, they have gone from mountain to hill. They have forgotten their resting place. Right, right, their resting place. All right, now, uh, read uh, Isaiah 28 and 11. So, like, 11 and 12. Isaiah 28. Uh, the brother Montessori got it. I got it. Oh, uh, 11, 28, 28 and 11 what? 11 and 12, Verse I got 11 it. 11 and 12, Okay. This is uh, uh, Isaiah 28 and 11. He says, For with stammering, stammering lips and another tongue will he speak to his people. And the Lord speaking through his prophets. You go into that word stammering, it means uh, to mock. So, yeah, we, we, we will be rude at times depending on the spirit you come in. So, because that's how the, uh, the, 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 whom the world eagerly calls Jesus, his name Yahweh Shah, the scripture says, What? He upbraided them. When you go into that word upbraid, it means to, to deride, to, to taunt, to chide. So sometimes you got to speak rough to our and, and in layman's terms, he gave you a good curse now. A tongue lash. Yeah, a tongue lash. He said, to whom he said, this is the rest. Wherewith ye may cause the weary to rest. Yeah, this is the rest. All right, this understanding, this knowledge, you're not going to make it in America. It wasn't designed for you to, uh, for you to make it. You still, th you still three fifths of a person. The Thirteenth Amendment still says what? That you can put, uh, you can put our people back into slavery if they, if they break a, uh, break a crime. You know what? They come up, they come up with laws against our people to put them in jail. Our people, when you, when you look at this, our people aren't out there breaking laws and, 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 and going to jail. The so-called white man uh, was the predominant uh, race of people in the prison system. Then they came up with. Uh, uh, vagrancy laws, because when they when they so-called freed us, we you just get these people on the plantation. Now, what, now where the fuck they gonna go? So now it's uh, oh, oh vagrant, oh you vagrant, oh you loitering, throw them in jail. So hey, but 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 this understanding, you knowing that look, America wasn't meant for you for you to make it. This is your punishment. Right. But if you if you hold on fast and you keep the words of my saying and do what I say, then I gotta I gotta a uh, for you. Yeah. That's the rest, the gospel that we're telling the people. But what? Is some more on that scripture? God, he says, to whom he said, this is the rest, where, where, wherewith ye may cause the weary to rest. Right. And this is the refreshing, yet they would not hear. Yet they would not hear. It's only for the elect, like the brother quoted Romans 11 and 7. He said, the election have obtained and the rest were blind. So hey, from, from our apostles and elders on down, the men of Great Millstone, we, we push we push the elect because the scripture pushed the elect. Right. Huh? And if I may add, you know, to you you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians out here complaining, you know what I'm saying, every day, like, like why 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 I can't, you know, get a good job or why I can't find a good husband, or why I can't get a good wife, or why or why this or why that. It's because, man, the scriptures say that this is not your rest. Hmm. Matter of fact, I'm gonna read it real quick. This is Micah 2 and 10. He said, Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted. It shall destroy you, even with a sword destruction. And that's talking about this, this, uh, this captivity we in, man. Yeah. America mainly. America, which is known as Babylon the Great in the scriptures, man. All of you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians trying to get your rest here, you're not going to find it here, man. You know, because this place is set up for destruction. And if you keep partaking in it, you're going to get destroyed with it. Come on, that's in Jeremiah you gotta, 50. You got you to gotta accept a lot of uh, things against the Bible. You got to accept homosexuality. Yep. You got to you gotta accept uh, uh, women being equal to men. Yep. Which it ain't. Like, you people, that's just, that's just nature. 
the, 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 the male lion is not equal to the female lion. Right. The, the, the male elephant is not equal to the female uh, elephant. But you people, then you got to accept transgender. See, America, they got they got transgender children. And we out here preaching against that. Where where, where all the other people, where the, where the pastors that complaining about that? Yeah. They got ABC Dateline specials about ten, about uh, these Edomites, uh, which is Esau. See, so, all the racism is in the Bible. That's the one thing people don't understand. You got the so-called white people, they pushing this agenda to make everybody homosexual because they say the world is overpopulated. And, and but, you, so like it real quick, I just want to say, hey, it's getting so work, man, it's getting so bad, man, that, man, you could go into Chicago, man, some of these damn churches, man, promote the LGBTQ right. community. Right. They yep. got their damn flag on the damn right. churches, man. Hey, and why, that is, that's why, because, hey, because that, that, hey, they want to keep getting that, they that, want that, that, money. that conversation. They want that money. They don't have to eventually get with the program, man. Precept. So we're going to start seeing a lot of that, man. Huh, and, and that's the point, yeah. man. A lot of these pastors, man, out here that y'all following, they, they done sold out for filthy that's, lucre, that's man. Right. Those right. are not the prophets of the Lord. Those are not the men of the Lord, man. The real men of the Lord out here in the highways and the byways, man, telling you the truth. Yeah. Right. Telling you to escape that, man. Get away from that, because they teaching you uh, 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 false doctrines and lies, man. You know, they telling you that, hey, uh, 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 the, the Lord loves everybody. You know what I'm saying? Even the uh, homosexual scriptures totally speak against that, and we can prove that right now. Yeah. You can get one of your brothers, man, real quick, get a, 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 a uh, Leviticus uh, 20 I'm and a, 13, or you got one? I got I'm over yeah. something because you pulled that, uh, you pulled that Mal uh, not Mal uh, Micah 2 and 10, right? I got okay. The brother said, rise ye and depart, for this is not your rest. It's going to destroy you even with a sword destruction. What's going to destroy you? You're going to be cut off in Babylon's iniquity. All right, this is Jeremiah chapter 50, 51. Verse uh, 6, it says, flee out of the midst of Babylon and deliver every man his soul. It says, be not cut off in her iniquity. For this is the time of the Lord's vengeance. And he oh, will... Oh, oh. Say that, read that loud. Come. It says, uh, uh, Jeremiah 51 and 6, flee out of the midst of Babylon and deliver every man his soul. Right, right. And that flee out of Babylon is not talking about literally flee out of Babylon. It's basically saying flee out of her way. Yeah. Yeah. Arise and depart. Come right. Uh, yeah. Arise and depart. Come up out of her ways, man. Don't partake in her ways, man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? And her ways don't have nothing to do with the scriptures. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Because like, like we was just saying a little while ago, those pastors in the church, man, they not teaching from here, man. They teach you from out of the, what the so-called white man gave them to, right. to tell you, man, to keep you docile, to keep you in the sleep, man, that's to right. keep you away from the heavenly father. Hey, and that that that, that escape, that rise up and uh, uh, don't take none away. Hey, look at uh, Noah, man. When Noah read, when Noah was making that ark, he preached out for a hundred years, man. Yep. And that was their way of fleeing. That was their way of fleeing. You know, what? because they 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 kept worshiping, believing in the Yahweh uh, and the Yahweh Shem Yahshua, the Father and the Son. And they kept building the ark. It took a hundred years, man. And they was telling the people, man, what's to come. Same thing as we doing, man. And when them, when them big ass uh, brain drops, man, hit them forehead, hit they forehead, and they seen that them it start raining from the heavens. Hey, they literally, <laughs> they, they literally probably in that time shit it on themselves. Yeah, man. And pissed yeah. on themselves, right? Man. He was which right. Is gonna, which yeah. is gonna happen again? It's gonna happen again. That's right. Man. When they see them them thermal nuclear missiles start coming over here, and you watching the news, your your TV just blanked out because one of the missiles they hit. Niggas gonna realize then, man. The men that was out there preaching, man, they had the truth, man. That's right. All right, because you've been being deceived out here, man. This place is not Disneyland. This ain't no no land of opportunity, man, like this man told you, man. All right, Esau is a lie and the father of it, man. That's right. All right? Hey, huh. you, you said something earlier about, uh, no, let me read that point for you. Oh, you can finish this up? Oh, you finish your your quote, time, time. This is, uh, flee out of Mr. Babylon, deliver every man his soul, be right. not cut. Right, that means, like, repent, man. Come. You know, because all your life, man, you've been taught false philosophies. You've been taught Christmas, Easter. You've been taught Halloween, all of these wicked holidays, Thanksgiving. Four for, for you lie. Four for you lie. <laughs> you know, four for, that's, not our, that's not our independence, man. That's right, Juneteenth. Deliver every man his soul. Be 
not cut off in her iniquity. Right. Don't be cut off in this. Don't, don't get caught up in this situation, man. Hey, right now it's time to uh, uh, soak the love. The scripture say it is high time to wake up out of sleep. This is the time right now to soak the love, man. Soak the love. Get that spirit to talk to you, man. This is hard, man. Wake the hell up before the Lord comes with that swift destruction. That fire and that brimstone, which will be new for some of this. You can't say it enough. That's an example that cut off of her iniquity. Yep. In this in this society, if you ride around with your friend, he got a body in the trunk, and he get pulled over, and you don't know shit about it, your ass going to jail. Right, so hey. what? You just got caught up in his iniquity, that's you know? Hey, you guilty by association. You guilty by association. Same people with this world. Hey, and the scriptures actually tell you what, man. Hey, I'm the brother of man. The question is how you're doing. You're not living right now. It tells you, look, man, let every man search out his own soul salvation, man. So you can't say, oh, well, I go to this church and blah, blah. Yeah, hey, man, no, man. You're going, you're, everyone is, a, is accountable for their individuality, man. Right, right. And, and, and I'm glad you said that because a lot of you people that go to these churches, you don't read the scriptures, man. That's right. You know what I'm saying? You, 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 just, feel, you just feel men, man, and what they say. Yeah. Instead of going off the scriptures, you got to search these scriptures, man. You know what right. I'm saying? You can't listen to your poor chop people pastor. You know what I'm saying? You gotta, you, look man, our people die from eating pork. That should tell you something right there. Like, wait a minute, something ain't right. Hey. Why, why, why the fuck is my grandmother getting a leg cut off? Yeah, hey, ain't no one else, that's crazy. If you study meat, if you study meats, man, why is it every other meat can be cured, be cured raw, and be cured and you can eat it, except pork. You can smoke pork and you can't, you can't make jerky out of pork. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You, even though you smoke it, you still have to cook it. You can take beef raw, lay it out of the smokehouse, Smoke it, and it actually cures, mm -hmm. and, and, and it's, 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 it's edible. You can lay it out in the sun. Yeah, you, yeah, you can lay it out in the sun. It dries out, but not pork, man. Yep. You can't even cook that shit. You cook pork, that shit still got a worm at it that doesn't die, man. Then, then five, ten years later down the line, you in the hospital with diabetes, getting your leg amputated. You wonder why. And then the first thing the doctor tell you, don't stop eating pork. You weren't supposed to be eating that shit anyway, man. That's why you got to come back to the statute laws and commandments of the most high, man. He, he get to the point where he even tell you, you don't eat shrimp no more. Yeah. You know, because you get sick from eating that too. Yeah, the, scavenge, the scavengers of the earth, Those man. are scavengers, man. Those, 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 not that they bad, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They, 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 they bad for us to yeah. ingest. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They, they was made to clean the earth, man. That's what they was made for. That's right. It, but it, it, it goes back yeah. to polluting your body. That's right. Because he eats the pollute, he eats the, the garbage he's, he's put here on earth for a reason. It, he has a purpose. Right, it's equivalent to, you might as well smoke cigarettes and do drugs. You know, it's <laughs> the same. do that, bro? <laughs> right, right, Kyle, it's the same shit. <laughs> It's the same, it's the same thing, man. It's like, it's like a toilet in your house. You right. Know, yeah. You want to go eat your toilet, which... Yeah. No, nah, you want to drink yeah, water. Toilet's not in your house, guess what? What are you going to, you know, do you mess at? You want to drink right. water out the toilet, you go yeah, to the yeah, motherfucking yeah, refrigerator. Yeah. yeah. Right, you ain't going to drink a glass of bleach. So yeah, it's good. So the brother's saying, like, it's good to earth to, to do what's good for. Yeah, so of course. And all know? people think this shit funny, man. Hey, it's all good. Hey, let them laugh, yeah, man. Hey, hey, you know what? The Lord going to laugh at you hey, in that day. John, you know, and Lord willing, we going to laugh with him. That's right. I mean. We're gonna be laughing with him, man. Praising the Lord and laughing at your simple-minded ass. Huh. You know what I'm saying? Cause you're not laughing at us. You not. You laughing at the Lord, who you ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Yep. Cause we speaking His words to you. Right. The yep. scriptures say in the book of uh, Luke 10 and 16. Somebody can get there real quick. Hey, can you finish that? I'm finna. I'm finna finish, I'll finish this. It says, uh, "Be not cut off in her iniquity, uh -huh. for this is the time of the Lord's vengeance." So this is the time of the Lord's vengeance. Mm. The way the world is being run, the, the God of the Bible is not pleased with that. And we out here telling you, can you get it? Uh, I quote it. Ezekiel three and seventeen says, "I get it." It says, "Give them warning from me." The why? Yeah. We out warning here warning me. you people. We out you people. You people don't even understand the concept that the God you believe in is upset and angry. Now you got the you got the Bible, you got history tells you what happens when the God of the Bible get upset and angry. Yeah. Floods, hey. famine. <laughs> what, 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 exactly what's it, happening, man. Right. Go ahead, read it, bro. This is uh Ezekiel 3 and 17. Right. He says, Son of man, I have made thee a watchman. What do watchmen do? If you're a watchman, you warn the people. You looking for danger, you see danger, and you warn people that danger coming. So that's what we out here doing. We see the danger through the scriptures. 
the, 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 look at the state of the world. Look at what's going on. Hey. Some should click in you people here <laughs> that something ain't right. Yeah. And yo, hey, hey, everything you give hope to, it fails, man. Right. Niggas thought Obama was gonna really change some shit, man. Come. Now he gone. Now, now what you gonna vote?